basically there's not a day I wouldn't go out. It's freezing cold this morning and while others want to stay home where it's warm, this Montrealer, Carlos Ebert Plante, sees this weather as the perfect time to catch some waves in the St. Lawrence River. Bodyboarding is my first love in what I started to do for the, when I was growing up in California. Since the age of six, Plant dreamt of becoming a pro surfer. But what keeps him going after 40 years of bodyboarding nearly every day is his passion for the sport, even during snowstorms. I feel it in my stomach. My heart's like, I, I just pounding, pounding, pounding. But my saying is I just got to go in. This section of the St. Lawrence River in Montreal is a popular spot for surfers and kayakers in the summer. But Plant has the waters to himself in the winter months. Before hitting the waves, the first thing Plant does is what he calls the hunt. So upstream, there's a big ice I can watch coming down that I prefer to stand on. So when I'll wait for it to come down and I'll swim to it, and standing on the iceberg will give me to, uh, to the wave. Once the hunt is done, he suits up in a scuba diving wetsuit. Despite the lack of layers, the suit keeps him warm from freezing temperatures. Getting over there, you're walking in snow to the knee height, so it warms up. Basically, I'm, uh, I'm really sweating even before getting water. So the water makes it just, just like perfect. He loves it. It's, it's not he likes it, he loves it. He, he, he feels the river. When I listen to the videos, I'm calm. It calms me. I'm like, when he does it with his GoPro, it's like we are in the St. Lawrence River with him. It's you alone with the water and your vision of the, the water and you're, you're just sliding. You're endlessly uh, sliding. Yes, it's a great feeling. I love it. In 2016, Plant completed a challenge bodyboarding for 365 days straight. He plans on retaking the challenge after his 50th birthday. In Montreal, Diona Makalinga, City News.